Oh, right. Hey, guys. Welcome back. This is part 16 of the Let's Play Brandenburg series in Europa Universalis 4 with me, Anthror. And that kind of rhymed. Anyway, <laughs> where we last left off, we are helping Austria out uh, in, an, in a French-Burgundian trade war that I really want no part of. So I just kind of ran away. And that's going to be my general uh, plan for this war. Because France has 90,000 men. And I don't want to fight them. Not until I can form Germany uh, and be buff. Because, oh, see here, the, oh, those are my boats. All right, so yeah, they have too many men. If they venture into our land, we'll we'll punch them in the heads. But until then, we're gonna just kind of sit back and continue making gold. Maybe we should probably build some forts and stuff. Grand fleet with twenty heavy ships. Uh, that will be something we do in the future. Right now, though, not so much. Yeah, I can't. I don't want to get. I don't want to get too close, because that 67k, they must be taking crazy attrition. 5% attrition. Damn. So that's like a couple thousand men every month. Hey, Bremen likes us more. Um, okay, new cardinal, not one of ours. Spain is now the Curia controller. They're our ally, though. Speaking of... Oh, that means we're not the Curia controller. You dicks. Uh, that sucks. Alright, so let's improve relations with them. Let's go back, and Austria is pretty happy with us. Russia should still like us because we're at war with them. Yeah, it's good. <laughs> Stupid Spain, taking away my Curia. Wow, they got three guys. I got two. They got four guys. Wow. Yeah, they're really, really powerful, Spain, in this game. Inheriting both Aragon and Naples is a big deal. Wow, Austria won that? Alright, let's get over here and do some damage then. Went down to Brunswick. Uh, we... Let's see, we're at level 13 military tech. France is at 13. Uh, Austria is at 14. That's part of the problem there. How is Austria not like significantly ahead of time? Ah, oh, they must really be ahead of time. That's crazy. Um, we're still four years ahead. I'm going to go ahead and take this. And get our extra discipline. Mantua pieced out. Espiritu de Corpus. I have no idea how to pronounce that. That's good though. So we are now topped off on our military ideas. Uh, well, on offensive ideas. That extra discipline is nice. And the force march is really good. <clears throat> Excuse me. So when we get over here, we'll go crush this army and then... Who knows what we'll do. All right. Cord Hamburg. That's awesome. And it's a Catholic province. That's beautiful. And then let's go to here. Take out these guys. I yeah, can get a new Diplo attack, but not just yet. Making some attrition. So let's take a look. I haven't actually looked at this. We have uh, more morale at the start. Uh, we have got 110% discipline, which means we're going to do more damage. And yeah, these guys are toast. Cool. Toast, 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 toast. Look at that. We're taking like almost no damage. So... They lost, uh, five, six, so oh, about 7,000 men, we lost three. This guy is no way to France. <laughs> yeah, now they're running away. Let's go chase them. This is who? Gallery. What do they even hold now? Oh, all of this. They're pretty big. Get him. Uh. Alright, so let's uh, split in half, split in half. Go here. Go here. Split in half, go here. We'll siege gallery. Kind of keep us away from the front lines a little bit. 
Then you guys can split in half, and half of you can go there. This will give us the ability to, uh, whoops. Reconvene if we need to, if France shows up. Hey, we got a another cardinal. So we're up to two against France, Spain's four, which is just freaking insane. But, uh, what are you going to do about it? I'm glad I said yes to this war. Looks like we're going to win. Austria's got a banging army. Uh, ba -da -ba -ba -ba. What's trade? Discovery? Akdama, Africa? Whoa, somebody discovered Africa? Arica. No. Yeah, Portugal is all over South America. <laughs> Otherwise, everything looks relatively normal. Oh, they're gonna come fight me? That's cool. Take these guys. Take these guys. Oh man, we got our prestige rocking. Boom, 100 prestige. Oh, we're on Iron Man, right? There's actually, I'm gonna do this, even though it's a really bad idea. Oh, there's a, there's an achievement for having three, uh, three stability. Oh, let's see, what is it? Oh, it's not alt tab. I can't remember what it is. Shift tab? It might screw up the recording, I'm not gonna do that. There's a, there's a, Achievement for having three stability, a hundred prestige, and a hundred legitimacy. But I think you might have to be at peace for it. So I'm not entirely sure. And boosting it. That's actually a stupid idea. I don't want to waste my points. Still pretty cool, though. Do 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 do. Sieging, sieging. <laughs> Let Austria take. Uh... Oh man, we're losing. Lots and lots of guys. Uh, let's go ahead. Select the army. Let's break off a uh, new unit. I'm going to just do... Move everyone over. Move the, these guys. And when these guys back, the rest of you guys go home. You detach a siege. Go home. I think you are already the maximum. Nope, you go home. You're here the most. And... You go home as well. We'll try to preserve some of our manpower here. We'll keep them pretty close in case anyone decides to come over and start messing with us again. But I want to try to maintain as much manpower as possible. Oh, diplomatic insult on Denmark. That's good. We're going to get to you, Denmark. In fact... Well, those guys are expensive. Never mind. <laughs> cool. Converted Potsdam back to Catholicism. Let's actually convert the capital now. That's too bad. This is really a crappy... A crappy religious... Uh, basically, it's just Denmark, England... Oh, our general died. Uh, Denmark, England, and Bohemia are the only ones that really want Protestant... Some bitch. Come on. See if we can get there. Ah, that's a long walk. We're gonna lose. No. That was stupid. Oh, we just got there in time. Alright. Russia's starting to piece people out. Get out of here. Alright, they're, they're completely dead now. All the cannons. One of these guys. Everyone else go to Brunswick. We no longer have our general. Um, we should probably get a new one. Oh, we got 80 tradition. That's probably going to be pretty good. Oh yeah. Oh yeah. Not bad at all. 
And then we'll do break off a single guy. We'll make him this guy. You can go to here, please. Good. That's a hell of a general. Uh, what rebels are you? Peasants, that's fine. And are you still liking me? Yes. How much, though? Okay, good. So we'll start uh, annexing, or integrating both of these guys at the same time. Oh, excuse me. Well, we have won a couple of sieges. You guys can go ahead and come home. But unfortunately, I do not have any claims on these guys. Where do I have claims? That's a good question. Not really any... Oh, do I have a... I do have a claim on Slavig. Now we're going to have to go to war with Denmark soon. Absolutely. We've won the Siege of Munster. We'll take these rebels out for our ally as well while we're here. Oops. Uh, let's put our heir in charge. That oh, gallery is pieced out. You're welcome. You guys come home. <laughs> cool. Take those guys out. Everybody go home. We're going home. Put a loo back. We are finished with this war. And you're getting... Are we still ahead? Two years ahead. Years ahead. Ugh. Let's save up that admin power. See if we can't maybe do something. Uh, we can definitely build some stuff though, especially things that require diplo power, like constables or admin. We have like one dock. That seems silly. You go here. Um. Marketplaces are good. Lots of money. We're still making 10. I'm going to keep my maintenance up for now because I do not trust uh, France to not come over here. Even though they've lost this war at this point. But it's also significantly weakened Austria, which is good for me. Um, you are not at war with anyone. Or, see, oh, you're no longer allied with Austria either. Anhalt, Alsace, Württemberg, and Liège. Pretty sure I could take all of those guys. Do I have a... Oh, I can't do it right now. I don't have a claim, though, but let's go ahead and get one on, uh, on Hanover. Seems like a good idea. Now these guys are no longer uh, vassals of... What's his name? Uh, Marriage, leading vassal. Hmm. I could get on halt. I could just go to war with them. Oh, they're allied with Poland and Trier. Uh, they would take vassalization. Let's go ahead and just do that. We'll go one over on our diplo, diplo relations. That's no big deal. Come on. Mantua got fully annexed by Milan. Uh, do, 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 do. And then we'll go and start making friends with these guys. I think we need Anhalt. And then at some point we're going to have to just punch the crap out of Saxony. Unless we get lucky and, and form a personal union with them, which is unlikely. <clears throat> What's this idea? Innovative. No more ideas right now. Oh, speaking of, how's our war exhaustion? Oh, not high at all. And inflation is mm, manageable.
Got too many relations. Oh, we can totally invest in a cardinal. We're gonna go for this guy. Let's we'll dump all our points. Good. Um, people controller. I would love to become people controller again. All right, we've topped off. All right, so those both of those guys will be ready to annex at some point soon. When do we have to wait for you? Seventy-four, five more years. Huh. Oh crap! We got caught. No, oh, well, we got very. We got no. No aggressive expansion. We haven't really done anything crazy for a while, so we've burned off everything that we got early in the game. I will go to war with Denmark soon. People states hanging out in Austria. We are good. We're not going to mess with anyone. We do now have this with Trier. In oh, man, they're allied with Denmark and England. Good for you guys. I guess we could probably fabricate another one on Denmark, too. Ottomans will give core Alcaric to the Mamluks. Ottomans will release Morea and Albania sovereign states. Oh, good. Goodness. This is Lawland. We want Lawland. <coughs> I think it's a pretty low base tax there. Yeah, two. Four. Those are little. We're just, we just want the land. Uh, yeah. Not bad. I'm sure Spain will take that. <laughs> we have Montenegro in this game randomly. Russia is strong. Uh, let's see. Locked at the end. Improve relations. Let's go ahead and top off relations with Russia. I really want to stay on their good side. I feel like they could be a big time ally for us later on. Oh, and no, we're still at war. So I don't want to. 4, 11, 5, 15. I think France is probably ahead of us in Diplotech. 12. No, we are actually. Oh, we could potentially take those guys up. Build some more buildings. Marketplace. Did we ever end up converting Chelmo's culture? I wonder. I think I may have. Such auto saves. Wow. Uh, nope, they're still Polish. Not causing any problems, though, so that's good. Almost done converting the capital. Get us back to Catholicism. Yeah, it's not really looking like any... Ooh, what is this? Provencial nationalists. So Savoy is about to lose Provence. Or Provence will respawn out of Savoy. <clears throat> Successful conversion. Very good. Let's move on to Lübeck, which will take a while because of the base tax there. End of religious turmoil in England. England is weak. We are still a year ahead here. Now, I think we wait, actually. I think what we're going to do is uh, get the next idea group, unlock trade ideas, take a couple trade ideas, take two of them, and then... And then we'll uh, start to get the... Uh, this will give us more trade power and another merchant. Yeah, for sure. And we'll let time tick, but let's see. Lubick is our place. So we need to maybe push more from... There's already five guys pushing there. We're pushing there. What else comes into here? We could potentially push some more from... Five there. There's plenty of guys pushing already. I don't know. We might just send a guy over to... Do we have any power over here? We're Brandenburg. Doesn't look like we have any power over here at all. Hmm. Maybe to the North Sea then. And see if we can't push a little bit more forward. And we'll build some more boats eventually and... Get them out there. Yeah, we're, we're... Oh, we can do it now. Good. Not ahead of time? Not ahead of time. Good. And we're going to go ahead and take our trade ideas. And we'll take the first two. 
we're also going to finish off our oppression ideas. The more army tradition, covert action, when we get caught, doesn't hurt as much, and lots of discipline. That's really good. Which they're nerfing in the Wealth of Nations. Not Wealth of Nations. Yeah, Wealth. <coughs> <coughs> oh, I apologize for that, guys. Did not have time to mute. Whew. There we go. Got an extra merchant. Very good. We're going to be making buttloads of money. Now, we cannot pass the Blasphemy Act, which requires us to have a ruler administrative skill of three. That's kind of random out of nowhere. Lower tolerance of heretics, but increase missionary strength. That is good. And what else do we want to do? So now we need to put our new guy to work. Uh, we're going to put him here. I'm going to transfer... And he'll arrive in 15 days, and we'll see if this goes up from 247 uh, to anything significant. Not significant at all. But when we get some more boats out, uh, into we'll get some boats out into the North Sea, and we'll be barely, we'll pull probably all seven of this down. <laughs> yeah, 60% is being retained, so we'll try to get as much of that out as we possibly can. And we'll send it to here, where we have 40% of the trade power. I need to punch Denmark to get some more of it. Maybe after this war. It's going to be a while before Austria is willing to fight, I think, because they're getting... They really hurt their military. But so did France, and that's good. Uh, we are over on our Diplo relations, which is a big... Not the biggest of deals, but kind of annoying. But we should be able to, I think it's, what did I say, 74 for Gotland. Yeah, so that's a ways off. But by the time this war is over, we'll be able to start uh, annexing Bremen. And then, before they're done, I should be able to start annexing Gotland. And let's start making our rounds and improving relations with everybody. And a six gold a month right now. It's costing us so much. I don't want to lose stability. Reinflation. Fuck. Stability it is. That's a crappy. Now religious unity is so expensive. Or it makes getting Oh, we're at plus one, it's fine. For now, we'll go up when we have the ability to do so. Um, okay, that's fine. <clears throat> we are still improving relations with these guys. Yes, good. Possibly just send them some money to hurry up the process. There we go. Should be a little bit quicker now. Get them vassalized, and that'll be good. <clears throat> Topped off with Spain. Anhalt has no claims on anything, but whatever we need. So we're going to need Leipzig, Thuring, Saxony, uh, Nürburg down here, which does not belong to Austria, which is good. I feel like we're getting pretty close to the, the German side of things. So we need Anhalt, Saxony, Leipzig, and Thuring, and Nürburg. Yep. So Anhalt, East 3, and then this one right down here. Definitely doable. Not going to be easy, but it's doable. I'm going to save up my money. I kind of want to build an embassy. I could use another diplomat. Um, I guess we might as well go and improve relations over here. And Austria as well. <laughs> kind of nice the war is won. We can just chill out. In fact, I'm going to turn down my maintenance because I don't think France has an army anymore. They still have their navy though, which is kind of annoying because I can't get my boats out. Oh, there we go. France will cede Burgogne, Burgogne, Burgogne to Burgundy. Uh, they will give core endeavors to Burgundy. They will release Provence and Orleans, Orleans as sovereign states. 
pay 129 ducats. Expensive as crap for Austria, but they're going to get a lot of prestige very well. So yeah, France just got kind of butt kicked. Which is good. So, Anhalt, Alsace, Wittenberg, and Liège. I don't have a diplomat. We'll see, though. <laughs> you guys are allied with Lithuania, France, and Galry. I have a... That's nice, actually. I've got a truce with Galry and France, so I don't have to worry about Lithuania. And I might be able to get Russia to come in. <clears throat> and then we could go and stomp all over Denmark and take a couple of things from them. I mean, they're not doing super hot. Uh, maybe we should recall... I come back from Saxony. Let's fabricate one more. Um, one more thing. Maybe... Yeah. Mid Midgilland. This is basically like free expansion. It doesn't piss off anybody in the HRE and gives me more more land, even though it's kind of crappy land. This place is too, yeah. These are I mean pretty low base tax, but still more land in, in Lubeck. And that is always good. Are you guys vassalized yet? Almost. Almost there. Come on now. One more month and we should be able to vassalize these guys. Let's wait till he's done in Denmark and that'll be fine. be a while before we can annex on Hulk because we're going to get uh, Baden and Gotland annex and that'll put a big old damper on their opinion of me. <clears throat> Come on now. Almost done with our missionary. It's good. Get that religious unity back up. Hopefully soon we'll be able to I get free unjust demands for a little while. That's pretty nice. All right, we have vassalized them. Very good. Now, so oh, what's this? Hey, now are we not too far ahead? We're not ahead. That's awesome. Next level. Very good. Superior unit types, which I believe were the these guys. Very good. Yeah, I like these guys better. And still on that. Cool. And in fact, let's go ahead and boost our this. Let's get our ships back out doing what they're supposed to be doing. Baltic Sea, thank you. Boom, we'll get prepared to go to war with uh leave until next year. Alright, we need to do this soon, so. I think we can probably take them by ourselves. If Russia will come in, we'll be we'll be super. We'll wait till the next month, and then we'll start this war. We're just gonna try to take Svig, uh, Slev, Slesvig, and Midtjylland, and then potentially Lolland. I don't know. What's their navy looking like, actually? Yeah, Ledger is what I wanted. Uh, navies. Denmark has got four heavies, 11 lights, and five transports. So nothing we don't think we can handle, that we can't handle. In fact, let's, uh, we're going to stop our trade fleeting for a minute. I want you guys to go to Mecklenburg. <laughs> yeah, so France shouldn't be able to come in because they have not they have a, what's this? Lubeck. Oh, I am, yeah, okay. Um, yeah, we have a truce with... Gallery and France, which is good. Gallery, I'm not so concerned about, but I would like to not fight them, just as I don't have to. Lithuania would come in. I don't 
I'm pretty sure they wouldn't take over the war. Uh, so if Russia will come, this is going to work out really well. All right, so we got our boats. We'll just leave them separate. Uh, let's see here. If I were to go to war, take stuff big. Austria, no. Spain and Russia, both yes. All right. Adios, Denmark. Uh, move our boats up to here. Our boats over to here. All right, so one, two, three. The rest of you guys go. One, two, good. And, yep, just Lithuania. No one else can. Up here. Very good. And Russia should just roll over Lithuania without much of a problem. Uh, oh, that's going to cost Lithuania that war. Should be good. Alright. You guys drop a siege and move over to Skane, or Skane, or whatever it's called. I want to siege our heart's content out here. Maybe we can, uh, we'll take what we want and then maybe we can make them release uh, some more Norway or something. We're gonna... Come on, buddy. Don't be afraid. Alright, pause. Uh, we'll do the prestige. We're about to get some more. We'll call Austria. Can't believe Spain came to this war. Pretty awesome. Alright, we cannot convert anyone else just yet. Because they have this stupid uh, religious zeal. Lorenberg, Lundberg. Says Lorenberg. When does that expire, does it say? 88. Wow. A while. But our religious unity is much higher than it was. Making some progress. Yeah, about time to wrap this video up. Maybe I'll go long on this one and just finish this war off. We'll see. This is working out swimmingly for us, though. As Russia is... Well, our idiot vassals are being idiots, but Russia's over just kicking the crap out of Lithuania. We're taking my guys, Austria. <laughs> we'll start moving up slowly into Denmark, and uh, mostly we're going to try to siege in Norway as much as possible. <clears throat> it is the winter, so we're going to probably take some pretty significant attrition. But our manpower has gone up quite a bit, and that is good. Leaving our boats here is smart, because then they can't do anything. They really can't get to us unless they walk all the way around. In which case, they have to go to Russia. Already, already winning sieges. Look at that. And their capital. Very nice. Um, come up to Blecken. Alright, there's the war goal. Oh, rebels. The hell? I can't see what's happening. Somehow they're not fighting. Oh, we're gonna lose. What the hell? And right, now they'll fight the rest of my guys. That makes so little sense. And, yep, run away all the way back to where... Yeah, that makes perfect sense. The hell? There, whatever. That was dumb. Uh, okay, moving along. Alright, you done running? 
Jesus. I'm up to here. Let's keep heading up. Oh, there's Denmark's army. Let's get them. Boom. Destroyed their entire army. Beautiful. Attach a siege. Keep moving up. They're going to return so much land to Norway. Okay. Finish the siege of that. Very good. Why don't you come up to here? Let's get our dude back. Well, and by the time this war is over, we'll be good to annex both Gotland and Bremen, and uh, and then on halt down the line. What's this? Innovative. Uh, I'd love to, but we need to save up for coring. You also at war with Sweden? Yep. Uh, Sweden's smart. We'll try to get as much stuff as possible. Uh, Gotland, you don't have claims on anything, do you? That's too bad. <laughs> do, 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 do. And after this one, only really one more thing to siege. We won the siege of Blaka Blaka. Very good. Move up to Ostergotland. And then... Come on. Get the siege, go to Jum... Jumlotland. No idea. Livonian order, how the hell did that happen? Interesting. Cool. Alright, and we'll just keep on sieging. Should have 100% pretty soon. Well, as close to 100% as we can get. <coughs> Excuse me. With uh, Sweden taking stuff up there. Re entered an alliance with Lithuania. Russia is doing their job down in Lithuania. Does Russia have any cores or anything over here? No. So we'll make Lithuania. I don't know. Maybe we can make Lithuania release something. Like Ukraine. Ah, oh, we'll totally make them release Ukraine. That's good for Russia, unfortunately. But uh, as long as Russia stays on that side of Lithuania, we should be fine. We got, what's this? Kurlandian Nationalists. Very interesting. Won a siege. Won a couple of sieges. Alright, we can actually start heading home now, I think. Yeah. Winning lots and lots of sieges. This is good. Gonna have significant Norwegian presence return to us. So I might just take three provinces. I'm gonna have to check what the aggressive expansion is gonna be. We've got 400 admin points. We can totally core it. Um, it's gonna not. It's gonna not make. I mean, Danish is not gonna become a. Not gonna become a accepted culture, unfortunately. But uh, what are you gonna do about that? Apparently we won a battle somewhere, up there. Must have just built a guy. Okay, come home. Do, do, do. Oh, are you guys done? Yes, you are. Why don't you come home as well? <laughs> we won the Siege of Ostergotland. Come on down to here. Do, 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 do. It's going to be interesting to see how much stuff we can get out of these guys. Siege of Smoland, very good. Smjalland, I do not speak Danish at all. Uh, Holland and Agder. That's Holland there, good, you guys come home. Uh. 
get a claim on Podlassie. Which is where is Podlassie? Right there. Oh, we've got a claim on that and everything. That's awesome. And it was occupied by one of my vassals. It is Polish culture the level set? I don't know. Maybe we'll take it. We'll have to see. Probably not. Um, let's lose the Diplo, because I'm going to need the admin to core. Almost done against Denmark. And then we'll see if we can't piece what we can piece out uh, Lithuania for. Although I don't know if I have enough actual war score to do anything. Oh, we got 28% war score. Yeah. Uh, release nations. Ukraine's 100%. That's not going to happen. Polsk is only one. Berlin's only one. Can make him return stuff to the Livonian order. Revoke cores. All treaties. Hmm. We'll see what happens as soon as we finish up Denmark. Alright. One more county to go. Nope, oh, blockaded. Oh my goodness. Yeah, speaking of, we can probably get our guys going again. Baltic. Lubeck. Get that money. All right. Good. Come on home, guys. And Lithuania. Get some peace out of you. Give me all of your gold. That's a start. Um, revoke your cores on Russian stuff. <laughs> Just make them give everything back to Livonian order. Actually, let's, all right, let's start with the stuff I definitely want, which is money. Um, and then you can uh, revoke cores here. And how close are we? Yeah, just we could maybe get something else out of them, but not full glassy. That sounds good. Give me your money, revoke your cores. That should make Russia happy. And Diplo power. Very good. Russia, you like me still? You should love me. For relations. Same. Oh, we have the same dynasty? Ha! Huh. I had no idea. That's awesome. That's sweet. Alright. Denmark. We got 99% war score. I am going to take probably these three, even though I won't be able to get to that one. That's a lot of aggressive expansion. Who's going to piss off? Denmark, Trier, Poland, France, Lithuania. Sa oh, Sax. No, oh, that's fine. All right. Um, return course to Norway. That's a lot. All right. Hmm. All right. Uh, clear. Clear offer. Maybe I won't take Lawland. I'll just take these two. Because I can't get to that. And that's kind of stupid. Um, so that's 29%. And then... Let's go with expensive stuff. Agder. That's at 87. That's too much. Anything under uh, Reykjavik? Shetlands. Um, this is a Reykjavik. That's fun. 
All right, let's see. Let's not do Reg if I can get some money. There we go. We still do. It looks like we can still do Regivic though. Cool. All right, so we will. Uh, we'll take two, and we'll give Norway four, and that should be good. Um, we'll take almost no aggressive expansion. And so we fifty. Yeah, perfect. Let's do that. And that means we'll still have a claim for the next time we need to go to war with them. I probably should have made them null treaties with France as well. Ooh. It's expensive decor, man. Why? Uh, local nobility. Alright. Inca? What? The Inca are Catholic. <laughs> are they westernized? No. That's funny. Uh, wow, the Ottomans are big. They took over a lot. Alright, cool. So that's good for us. We're going to core those two. Uh, get nice and big. Norway should love us. And they do. <laughs> Heretic religion, return territory 160. Man, they're going to like us for a long time. What's this? Military access from Sweden? Are you still at war with Denmark? Yeah, totally. I've had it. We're eventually going to just take the rest of Denmark. <laughs> cool. Alright, let's build some stuff. Should we build road network? We need... Canal before we do that. Canals. We can build some canals. Let's just do them in the most valuable places first. Oh, that's, that's good. Alright, there's all our money. But we'll get more trade power out of it. Which will give us more money in the long run. So we're making 15 right now at full maintenance. Let's drop maintenance down. 20 gold a month. And a very long video. So as soon as these two guys get home, we'll be good. Uh, we'll start fabricating some claims. Hopefully uh, what Sweden will do is uh, force them to annul their treaties. Oh, they have no treaties. Cool. Or annul their alliances. Looks like they already lost it. Oh, our heir died. And we got a much better heir. Awesome. Albrecht Achilles. Kind of a weird name, but sweet. Alright, cool. So I'm thinking I'm going to wait until our manpower gets up to like 30,000, then we'll build some more men. Um, improve defenses in Marienburg. Let's go ahead and do that. I love that it auto-saves when I'm like, I'm going to build a fort. Where the hell is Marienburg? There it is. Start saving up some more money, and because uh, I keep forgetting that I want to build an embassy. How are we doing as far as votes go? No one's voting for us. Oh well. <laughs> they are voting for Savoy, which is weird. Um, we've got two free Diplos. Let's see. Austria is fairly topped off. Spain is fairly topped off. Russia is fairly topped off. Oh, yeah, let's start actually annexing our vassals. Let's do that. Annex you. And annex you. Good. And then um, they're still improving relations with these guys, right? Yeah, looks like it. <laughs> yep, 40 more. So we'll get those guys topped off as well. Um, and then we'll talk about annexing them. So we'll take a little bit of a hit from annexing uh, uh, Bremen. But what are you going to do? And getting Gotland will be good. And also have lots of G's. I don't know why Russia's hanging out in Lithuania right now, but... We lost our claim on that, but we're already coring it, so it doesn't matter. And those cores are going to take a while. Fortification effort. Last person gets that for 50 gold. Yep, we'll do it. Hmm. I would like to get Hanover eventually. 
and then this stuff. You guys, you have an air? Yep. <laughs> Man, we have a really good air coming. What? Austria is requiring class their aid in the Trierian Hessian trade war against Trier and Liege. It's a defensive war. We need to help our ally. I am totally down for this war. This puts us at war with exactly who we want to be at war with. That's beautiful. Ah, alright. We're not actually going to... We're gonna head. We're gonna start doing this, but we're gonna end the video here because it's already gone way, way over. Uh, so the next video will come down. We'll see if we can't get anything out of uh, Trier. Perhaps Hanover. I feel like maybe we can get Hanover. Uh, but we're at war with just Trier. It looks like so. We just definitely need to get down there and and siege Hanover, and uh, maybe Austria will give it to us if we're lucky. All right, cool. With that one, guys, I will see you in the next uh, video. Thanks a lot for joining me. Have a good one.